We're up to part eight of our conversation with Greg Godovitz. I'm John Bowden from Rock History Canada. Greg has done so much for Canadian music, and he knows so many international artists. It's amazing the stories he tells. He wrote these two books. We'll have links in the description where you can pick them up. It's amazing his history in music, being an early member of the band Flood. Then, of course, his solo stuff and Gatto. Here's our conversation with Greg Godovitz. How did you meet him? I met him through Jeff Healy. Uh, Jeff had Luke come. Well, I guess we should clear this up. It's Steve Lukather. Not everybody knows him as Luke, but from Toto, probably the most recorded guitar player in history when you go through his discography. So he was he was going to guest with Jeff's band, which also included the great Pat Rush, who played with Johnny Winter playing guitar. They got me there to sit in with the house band to do the opening set. But then when Luke came out, Jeff said, I think we should get Greg up here to direct traffic. So basically, we didn't need four guitar players. In fact, I looked at it at one point and you know, said, what's it like? And somebody just went, you know, it's like, it's a toss, you know, four guitar players. So I got a cigarette, which you could do back then, and a glass of wine. And if it was Lukather's time to play a solo, I would point at him and I would point at Pat Rush and I would hit Jeff with my bum in his shoulder when it was his turn to play. And I gave Luke a copy of this book, which he almost read the first night that we met. The next day I came back, Gatto had a gig, so I couldn't play with him the second night. And uh, he got on his knees and did one of those, we are not worthy things to me. And we became instant friends. He says, man, what? A I remember when I went up when Toto was playing uh, at Casino Rama and at the table was Leland Sklar, the bass player. Speaking of. Yes, no kidding. Greg Fillingaines from Stevie Wonder's band, Simon Kirk from Bad Company, Mark Rivera from Billy Joel's band, Luke and me. And Luke says, this is my friend Gatto. He is exactly like us. He just didn't get that extra bump in the career. And instantly I was one of the boys. I was telling stories, making them laugh. Leland and I got together afterwards talking about, he says, do you ever, people ever give you guitars and stuff? I said, yeah. He says, well, I got this terrible story. He says, this company gave me about 10 bases and they were all sort of garbage. So I sold them. And then they called me up and said, we need a photograph. <laughs> I said, I've, I've been there. I've done that. <laughs> so it was, you know, it's great because like, like I said before, if you're normal around these guys, they treat you like, one, they, they just don't want people going, oh, 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 you know, and they can't talk, you know. We'll have more from Greg Godovitz in the next three, four days. Make sure you comment on our videos, subscribe to our channel and share our videos and buy a Rock History Canada t-shirt. Help support our channel. I'm John Bowden. Take care of yourself.